Tropical Cyclone Warning Centre Brisbane has upgraded Invest 90P to Tropical Cyclone Howard Category 1. Sustained winds in the centre at 65 kilometres per hour with wind gusts in 95 kilometres an hour located within 35 kilometres and 9 decimal 8 degrees south. 156 decimal 8 degrees east is about 350 kilometres west of Hoddy and 1430 kilometres east and northeast of Cairns. Tropical cyclone Howard is currently tracking south east at 10 kilometres an hour. System is forecast to track towards the southeast while intensifying as it approaches the Solomon Islands Friday morning. Longer term, the system is expected to continue moving towards the southeast and may affect Vanuatu late in the weekend or early next week as a Category 3 severe tropical cyclone. The system is expected to remain well offshore from the Australian coast and poses no threat to Queensland coastal or island communities. Now here's the latest from the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre. Formation of a significant tropical cyclone and possible within 120 nautical miles either side of a line for 9 decimal 6 degrees south, 156 decimal 4 degrees east to 12 south, 162 decimal 5 degrees east within the next 12 to 24 hours. Available data to start to justify issuance of numbered tropical cyclone warnings at this time. And they have it located 221 nautical miles west of Hoddy Hour, Solomon Islands, animated multi spectral satellite imagery and an 89 gigahertz microwave image depict deep convective banding wrapping into a low level circulation. 90p or tropical cyclone Harold is in a favourable environment with dual channel outflow, low to moderate 10 to 20 knot vertical wind shear and 29 to 30 Celsius sea surface temperature. Global models generally agree that 90p will continue to consolidate and strengthen as it tracks south eastward. This is the current position on the centre. Now here's a look at the NOAA floaters on the tropical cyclone. Solomon Islands Meteorological Service is now on board. They uh, issued an advisory at 1.50pm this afternoon local time. Special weather advice current for the entire Solomon Islands region. At 1.26 p.m. this afternoon, a tropical low central pressure of 1,000 hectopascals was located near 9 decimal 4 degrees south, 156 decimal 4 degrees east, and makes it about 61 nautical miles, 112 kilometres south of Sibbo Island. Expect gale force winds 34 to 47 knots or 63 kilometres an hour to 87 kilometres an hour over uh, southern waters or western Guadalcanal, Makira, Rennell, Bologna provinces in the next 24 hours with rough seas and high swells. Expect winds of 25 to 30 knots, maximum gusts of 40 knots over remaining waters and land areas, moderate to rough seas with moderate swells. Heavy rain, thunderstorms expected over all provinces. 
the bad weather associated with the tropical low poses threat to lives and properties and may lead to possible landslide, flash flooding over communities living near hill slopes close to large river streams, low lying areas. Motorists have been advised to use extreme caution. Now here's a look at the GFS model, accumulated precipitation, and we'll have more later. Also across the regional AU channel. You can follow Force 13's outlets, the website force13.com, our YouTube page youtube.com forward slash force13, on Facebook under the same name Force 13 and our Twitter handle, it's at Force 13 if you wish to get in touch. You can also add Force 13 on Skype and my personal account on Discord Fool 13 at extension 9094.